Hello and welcome back to Drama Bear Channel. Welcome back to new music reaction video and I've got so many requests for this specific song that I just had to do it and we're listening today to new song by Jungkook that has just been released today and it's called Never Let Go. This is going to be my third time ever reacting or listening to Jungkook so I'm pretty excited about it. Let's do it. Before I press the play button, we have an image that we can review and read out um, and it says, it looks like a piece of paper that says Never Let Go, which is the title of the song, of course, and we have more text. Every day I wonder if this all is just a dream, everything falls into place because you're right here with me. I'm grateful for you. Without your love, I'm nothing. You mean more than you know, and words escape me whenever you're close. I wonder if this is maybe the lyrics of the song. We'll see about that. If I remember correctly, uh, in one of the comments they said something that this song is addressed for the fans, so then we understand the meaning of being grateful for you. It is so cool and special when the artist is acknowledging his, her, their uh, fans and create work specifically targeting the fans as a thank you gift. It's so amazing. So let's press the button and listen to it. Out of town, we never out of money. We're never out of money. That's a good message. This is definitely a lot more dense than I would have anticipated or expected just from reading the text. Uh, somehow I thought it would be more of a of a ballad-like song about you know being grateful and so on, but it's a lot more dense and it gives me also a little bit like a South American kind of a rhythmical uh, feeling about it. It's more of kind of beach vibe to it. And yeah, it's very, very light and really positive. I like it. It also gives me somehow vibes of Justin Bieber. I don't know if you agree with me or not, but I don't know if there's any correlation with producers who helped produce this song, or I actually heard that uh, Jungkook actually wrote and produced the song himself, but maybe there's inspiration or, or there's something about the, the voice, about the effects on the voice, but uh, I really love how positive the message is. Okay, I think everyone definitely gonna remember the title of the song because it has been repeated many, many times, so I'm sure it's gonna catch up with people pretty fast. So as, as I understand now, listening for the third time, Jungkook, all the vocals has been uh, sang, recorded by him. There is no other people that singing in the song, but so everything blends really, really nice. Never let go, 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 go
It is great timing for the song because it is so summer and party and outside. It's really, really fitting for the season. And also with all the repetition with go, go, go and so on, really kind of screams clubbing somehow, more like kind of DJ vibe club and stuff. So very nice. Never let go. It's a very sweet, light, positive, optimistic song. Like I said, really fitting the season, the summer, the sun is coming out. Um, the song is very catchy, like, because it's so repetitive. And I'm really curious how the song would be performed live. It's definitely going to be hot and fun. Out of town, we never out of money. To me it sounds like the song has been produced purely digital, all the instrument sounds to me electronic, uh, except for maybe for guitar, I'm not sure. I uh, Now thinking about it, I think someone also mentioned in the comments that he sang, produced and played guitar for the song himself, uh, so maybe this part is actually acoustic, it's a bit difficult to say, to me it still sounds kind of electronic, it could be a combination. Everything goes into place cause you're right here with me Without your love I'm nothing, you'll be more than you know And words escape me whenever you close he did such an amazing job layering all the vocals, all the background vocals. They sound so rich and polyphonic and complex and they very constant, so they really support his main vocals. And like the blending and the harmonizing, so uh, very, very beautiful and effective. I like this pre-chorus section, it's a little bit different from the verse in terms of this kind of Latino rhythm fading out and it becomes a little bit more as a house music with a kind of drone um, undertone and then a very kind of digital snare drum kicking in for the energy before the chorus. And like it's a little bit anti-drop uh, in a way because this nadrum was building building up and it could have been very heavy kind of rhythmical drum or drone sounds instead it is more of a clap or like a snap sound so kind of the texture is still very light so it's he really keeps it under control so the song doesn't become kind of heavy it's very summer feeling to it still With this very crazy synth in the background, kind of almost scratching, kind of weaving around. The structure of the song as well is very light and simple. We have a little intro, but otherwise it is verse, chorus, verse, chorus. There is no bridge or anything like unexpected or crazy. So it's very light and almost like asking you to put it on the loop, on the repeat and keep dancing and just having fun. I think we got a good idea about the song. It's really sweet, it's really nice as a message to the fans, as a thank you and giving us basically a great fun time for the coming summer. Thank you guys very much for suggesting this song, I hope you enjoyed my reaction video and as always don't forget to like, subscribe, leave your comments, more suggestions and I hope to see you in my next video.